And if so, petrol will be ours, which means we'll have a spare army to send northwards. Because there are some guys that I would like to have words with. Victory! Oh, yes. Ooh. Hello. Hello, hello, indeed. Okay. Uh, before we do anything, we're just going to save over that one. It's the save that I made for my break. And Philippos the Thinker. Hello, sir. What have you got, exactly? Not much. Your typical bridge suicide squad. I think we can take them. I hope we can take them. <laughs> because if we can't, we've got a few more pressing issues. But I'd imagine we, we'll be alright. Philippos the Thinker should have stayed home today. The Valiant profit more than their country than the finest, cleverest speakers. Not necessarily. This will be a bloody one, come what may. There stands the army of the Seleucid King, proud and confident to a man. But they die like anyone else, so do not fear them. We won't. They will try to cross in force. This we cannot allow. They must fail. They have a slight advantage in numbers, hmm. but Al only 1,500 men or so. We must slaughter the enemy from a distance with missiles and wear them down. That is the point of holding this choke point. I have never yet lost a fight against these men. I have no intention of starting today. So together, we will gain another victory. When I set my heart on an attack, I do so knowing that I will win, that my men will win, that victory is within reach. All we need to do is stretch out and grasp the foe firmly by the throat. Hooray! Throat grabbing. The omens have been For sure. I say omens are for bitches. Apparently so does Drusus. Okay, so you get to be unit number one. You will be standing right on the bridge. Which means your fellow Prinkapay units will be unit officially group number one. I'll make the archers group two, and they can sit over here. No, you really don't need to be spread out that much. And the slingers can be group three. You guys can sit over here. And you guys will be the reserves. And you'll just sort of stand around looking generally. Now I saw that they had a couple of units of archers. So we'll hopefully be able to deal with them when the time comes. It'll depend on where they put them, really. Anytime I could. Yeah, thanks. And you guys advance like so. And you gentlemen, just stand around. Looking gentlemanly, and you stand over there. Now, he does have a surgeon, so I sh don't think I have to be quite as worried as I was about the whole losing these troops. Hopefully, if we're lucky, we'll get some of them back. Is everybody on fire at will? Yes. So we want to take out these units of Persian archers, first and foremost. So once they get into range, we'll order them to start shooting. These guys, the archers should take care of these fellows as soon as they come within range. It looks like they're the only unit that will be within range on that side. And you... Should pretty please when you get the chance. Kill all these bastards. Who's not within range? Oh you. Okay, you just stay there then. Yeah, there you go. And you guys are all shooting at them, I should think. Perfect. Oh no. Shoot shoot at them. Beautiful. So we'll probably lose a few guys to these archers, seeing as we weren't shooting at them straight away. Or maybe not. Um, our arrows are making quick work of them. So perhaps we won't have to worry at all. That, that was beautiful. I loved that. I loved every second of it. Oh, no. We lost a couple of guys. Because they did start shooting. But that is okay. Please murderize these people. There you go. They've stood for a long time. I'm kind of impressed. Just a little bit. 
So that should be that, and we can get down to the business of killing the infantry. Hello. Is that their general? Well, I know that's not their general, but the general cavalry is up ahead. Whoa. Nice bridge, bro. Yeah, there he is. If you want to charge in right at the front and give me an immediate advantage, I am okay with that. You know, I am 100% on board with this plan, and I approve. Looks like he's trying not to be quite such an idiot. He did think about it, after all. I'm wondering if I should order these guys in now. We're holding the bridge pretty well. These gentlemen are doing their jobs. Hmm. I'm wondering though if I shouldn't just order them in straight away anyway. Just to be safe. Yeah. I mean, what are they going to do? They're just going to sit back anyway unless I order them in, so get to it. Good god, two frames a second. The game is not happy about this. The game's like, why? Why do you do this to me with all these people on the battlefield? What are you doing, you son of a bitch? So, I guess, you know, we, we get to view some of the fight in slow motion. Looks kind of cool, though. I do like this whole perspective. Just watching them crash against your men. Wow, they are really, really hurting my Prinkapes. Is that because they're all charging, or because... They're running. It looks like charging. We'll get in there. Stop them. Stop them from doing the thing. Stop them from doing the thing I don't approve of. Where's the general? Oh, there he is. He's right there. So we'll zoom back out again so we get more than two frames a second. And I guess we will have to hope that our guys break these fellows quickly and that the general runs into us and, you know, dies. Because I would appreciate that. I really would. There's a lot of shaken fellows. Where is General McGeneralson? Oh, there he is. He's, uh, well, I think that's him. Right here. Where'd he go? saw him. There he is. General Generalson. Oh, he's the only one left of his bodyguard unit. So as soon as he runs into my guys, I'm hoping that means that they'll just be like, oh, hey, stab. Oh god, why? And the general's dead and then everybody runs. Yeah, the Indian spearmen aren't doing so swell. Um, I'm going to withdraw my missile units, I think, in a second. I'm going to stop them from firing. No, stop shooting. Alright, now stop. Gotcha! The enemy general is slain, and now his men yes, they do. Us. It is time to press the attack! Yep, there they go. Okay, you guys get to just run back out of the fight. Unit number four, murderize. Okay, you guys shoot at them. And you guys can withdraw for realies. Hopefully we will break these guys as they run at us. Okay, there we go. Everybody withdraw. Well, everybody who doesn't have to be here, that is. Oh, crushy, crushy, smash, face smashy. Beautiful. Now, what's the casualty list gonna look like, I wonder? Because it's not gonna look good. It's gonna look a little bit painful, I should think. Yeah, still a the thinker. Didn't think too hard about this plan. Yeah, kill them all, please. The enemy's you have crushed the enemy. Yes, yes, we have. 3,969 kills.
Wow. <laughs> wow. Princopes, we got 90 back out of the 118 casualties. Pretty good. We can probably condense one of these units of Princopes, well, two of them, into one. Not bad. And how do we go on the whole slingers and archers thing? We got most of them back. Okay. That's the thing I was worried about. Because when they have ranged missile troops, I do not like it. Because they can kill my ranged missile troops. It's, well, it is rather depressing when they do. Oh, hello. Hello. <laughs> you, you did talk to those guys in charge of the massive army that was just here, right? No? Okay. Well, if you want to die, I will oblige you. This, this should be interesting. And our spy net should be able to tell us in the next in the next turn whether or not we can advance to take more cities. These solution soldiers think they are as good as we are, but they are wrong. Yes, we just killed Philippos the Thinker. They are wrong. They will not survive. So you get to be up first, and you will be his second. As will you. Archers. No. Hmm. Archers to the left of me. Slingers to my right. And here I am, stuck in the middle with them. Alright. You, get over here. And you guys... I want to try the archers out on the left this time, because they did pretty well. And they didn't end up killing that many of their own men. But the slingers did kill a couple of their own people, so I want to see if this makes a significant difference. Oh yeah, shoot. Shoot the shooty stuff. And you guys... You're the reserves again. Be reserve -y. Hello. This is my bridge, welcome to it. Oh, you're dying. Yes, you are. Oh, dear. Oh, dearie me. And I'm going to put one unit onto fire arrows. Because I do sort of want to break these guys fairly quickly. And you guys can advance. Alright, the general's all the way at the back. That is unfortunate. That is indeed unfortunate. Ow. We will deal with it. You guys, charge. Get in there right away. None of this pussyfooting around. These guys are all shaken. So I'm hoping that if we break one or two of them, the whole lot will just be like, Hey, we should all charge blindly into them. Nothing could go wrong. Now where is General McGeneral Pants? Is he actually all the way back here? No. Or if he is, it's just not telling. I don't know. He's around. That'll do. <laughs> Wavering, broken, fighting for the death. Shaken. I'd be pretty shaken up too. Yeah, I can't see where the general is, but I'm imagining he's in this back unit. Not a big deal. Let's fast forward it up a little bit. Yeah, there we go. Our perfected method of bridge smashing, crunching in on the front to make sure that they can't get in. Are you about ready to run? Almost. Actually, our archers have stopped firing at about the right time. I'm okay with this. Hmm. Actually, no. No, I'm not. Shoot at them. These guys are only shaken. We must make them run away. And now they are steady. We must fix this state of affairs. You guys pull back. You guys pull back too. You guys attack. Kill these sons of bitches! 
You owe me a mercenaries and not worth my time. Get him! Was that a retreat I heard? I think it was. Murderize them. Oh, now they're steady again. Damn it. Would you people please just run into the fucking attack? Any time now would be great. I'm just gonna fast forward it. There we go. Great gods be praised. The enemy general is killed. Fear makes a home in our enemy's hearts. Yes, fear home enemy's hearts. Really, you guys are actually putting up a fight. That's that's interesting. Okay, sure. You have fun with that. My mercenaries will eat your faces. Virtue. They are not soldiers, only frightened rabbits running from our men. No. All Rome will be amazed. Yes, yes, Rome amazed such victory. <laughs> it sounds like one of those really, really bad doge things. Much victory. Such killing. Wow. I feel dirty. <laughs> we got almost all our Prinkapes back, so that's a plus. And the bridge was held yet again. Surely these guys have figured it out by now. Victory! Cheers. Oh, and this is our poor admiral. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Goodbye, admiral. You did well. I thank you for your sacrifice. An agent was found in Ratiaria. And in Tyre. And in Petra. Oh, yeah. We got the Petra. But apparently we didn't get to choose whether to murder them. Or I missed it. Hmm. This could be problematic, because usually the whole thing about being able to hold on to these places without doing Jack Diddly Squat is because there's not many people in them. Hmm. This could be an issue. I guess I could let them have it back. And then do it properly, but no. No, that that would be silly. That would be silly. Now, do I have a killer guy around here somewhere? I thought I did. You're pretty good. What's your chance? 50-50. Do it. Oh. How about you? 40%. Nah. Kill him instead. Get some practice. That's how you do it. Placus the killer. Is that my spy? No, that's their spy. Ooh. Hello. Oh, that's my spy as well. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Of course. Um, do I want to send you in there? Yes. Oh. Solid. Yes, master. Extra solid. Yes, master. Ooh. Unexpected. At your service. Oh wow. That guy only had a 39% chance. Maybe I should have been a bit more careful. Maybe I should have read these things. So let's get rid of these, because they're all about the spies and assassins, etc. etc. You sir, you worry me a little bit. Um, didn't I hire an assassin around here who was really good? Assassin yes, I did. Alright, get over here. Ooh, only a 22% chance, huh? Cut your teeth on this guy. There we go. Superior assassin. What are you now? This man has more cunning than a sack full of hungry weasels. <laughs> I love it. That's beautiful. That That is great. Okay, um, faction announcements. No, Numerius the Harsh, he is dead, finally. He took a while, actually. Hmm, Numerius the Harsh, you are a dead man. Caius Emilius Scorus has been born. I think he was Augustus's son. And I guess we'll have to have a look and see what these guys are good at. So what are you good at, first off? Unlucky leader, huh? Ooh. Wait, what? This man... Hang on. 
This man has the ability to inspire his followers in battle, his setbacks seem more the result of bad luck than a lack of talent. Oh that's cool, so he's not fantastic at command, but his troops believe in him. Nice, I like that. He's a grower, he hates grasping Carthaginians. Yep, he's an obsessional trainer. He likes a drink, he's handsome, he's a considerate governor. He's a benevolent ruler. That's actually pretty good. He's he's decent. He's young and he's a student. I don't know whether or not I want to send him with dear old dad. Because he would be pretty good. He'd be decent as a general. He'd be brilliant for taking over places. Because he wouldn't be staying there very long anyway. So I'll have to have a think about that. What about you, Tiberius? You take after your father, you're apparently loyal, you're flexible, you're a poor disciplinarian, restrained like a drink, and young. You're you're basically nothing. Oh, and the other guy's here too. Okay, well, we'll find a city that doesn't have anybody in charge. You are also kind of meh. Untruthful. Plain, open-handed, a minor... No enemies, a gourmand. So you should go to a place where there's mines. Preferably. So Croton sounds like a decent spot for you. Did you increase or decrease how much money they're making? You didn't really help or hinder. I guess we'll find out whether this was a good plan at some point. Do you have an academy here for making sure that young Romans get good stuff? You do. Excellent. And that silver mine will hopefully be useful. Now, you, sir. Oh, this was the miner. I'm an idiot. Okay, you can have Tarentum then. You actually reduced how much income they have. In that case, you get nothing. Go back to Rome. <laughs> And you take over here. Okay, so they lost a little bit of money, probably because he's got the whole tax man inefficiency thing, but I'm banking on him helping by increasing the population. So we'll deal with that as it comes. Recruitment. We have many mans. And Carthago Nova has a new spy. Excellent, because now I can send the spy to go investigate stuff. How good are you? Yes, master. You're not bad. I can approve. Did we... Imperator. Actually, we'll deal with that in a minute. Um, you have the ability to besiege them, so Prepare do so. The gates are soldier. open, as expected, just siege. as planned. Get me some more Iberians. Even though we'll send these guys in first, because they are the meat shields. We'll throw down a quick save. Did we get anything good? Yes, we got some troops in Utica and Thapsus to maintain public order, and Kyra. Same thing. Uh, you... Wow, is, is that you? I guess so. Yes. A subterfuge genius. I approve of this. <laughs> Even with all your subterfuge, you can't get into that city, so get into this one. Excellent. Actually, did I remember to... No, I did not. Go away. No provincial barracks for you. If you take this place back, it will be useless to you. Useless, I say. Did I do it with Tyre? Apparently. Yes. Okay, good. <laughs> More money for me, and those guys, they're not getting anything out of it. 21% chance, huh? At 20, 30, hmm, go for the 30, nice, good job dude, well done indeed, successful assassination, and you, how good are you, anytime I can double click on you would be great, thank you, assassin ready, 62% chance, I'll take those odds. Nice. 
Assassin ready. Very nice. I approve. Alright, now, construction. Patavium has a Roman citizenship at long last, so we'll begin recruiting a legion from them. Probably just use it to maintain order, etc. Lots of places built temples. You finally built that third phase auxilia. Excellent. Which means, if we so wanted, we could get chariots of our own. Oh, Galatian chariots are fearsome devices covered in scythe blades. So I guess these are the uh, the regional version of those Drapone, Drapona thingies. Those chariots. The scythe chariots that the Seleucids had that they were making short work and mincemeat of my Thracians with. Okay, that's good. Elysia has paved roads. Excellent. As the paved road network gets built over here, we'll be all good. Uh, in that case, you can build temples just to maintain public order, etc. And then queue up a phase one auxilia, because why not? And most of these other places have got what they need. You have nothing that you can really build. You're always going to be a backwater village anyway, no matter what I do, so I'm not going to worry about you. Syracuse has a Lyceum, basically temples and good stuff, and Apollonia has highways. Excellent. Can Thermon build highways? No. Antigonia? No. I wonder why I built him highways there when he didn't really help by having them. I don't know. I do things, sometimes I don't remember why I did them, but I do them anyway. Now. Part one of our ma of our master plan to take over the rest yes, of Egypt. Attack. Build me a sat point. I was hoping we might have been able to get in there already, but apparently not. That's okay though. We will survive. And the end of ten report was we made money. Well, technically we lost money, but we made money on top of what we had, and that's what counts. What's your shot? 46. I'll take those odds. Oh. Shouldn't have taken the odds. <laughs> I think his name is what protects him. It's like, do you know Captain... <laughs> Captain who? Uh, stab. Yeah. Nobody knows who this guy is. Uh, you are building a phase 3 auxilia. Excellent. You are building all of the things you need to build. What are you not building for? Build highways. Why not? Highways are good things. And apparently there's rebels in these inland seas blocking my trade, so I can't make money. Because lol. I wonder if I could even build ships in these inner seas. Are there any places that have um, timber so you can build ships? I don't think so. That's amusing. That is amusing. Okay, so, hypothetically, if I was to take every single last one of these guys out, you would be kind of annoyed by me. I see. Okay, what if I took every single one of these guys but left these fellows too? You would still be rather miffed. This is unfortunate. Okay, what if I grabbed these guys? You'd still be rather annoyed. I'm going to have to leave somebody there to hold on to the city, aren't I? Do I have a spare general? Anyway. Not really. I don't think so. Uh, Brutus is busy. Pretty much everyone except you is busy, and I sort of need you. Do I have somebody who's good at governing around here somewhere? Actually, yes I do, don't I? Of course, I have you. Do you have any good traits to making sure that people don't get annoyed? Hmm... Not really? Okay. Uh, what about you, Appius Fabius Maximus? You are an outstanding speaker, which gives you extra influence, but not really overly helpful. Ah. Uh, so the answer would be no. Hang on, what have I got here? I've got fresh troops coming in. Okay, if I put them on the boat and I offload them 
here at Tyre. Oh, I can't. Okay, well, they're sitting in a port. That's good enough. Um, I was hoping maybe I could borrow them. Okay, well, I can't send these guys. I can send these guys. And Jerusalem will still be happy, but they'll be able to take it back with, like, one unit. So, you sit in there. Make sure that Jerusalem is happy but guarded. Um, hmm. Okay, what about you? You're actually pretty chuffed about everything, so if I send you guys... What are we up to? We're up to 55% public order. Fuck yeah! God damn it. Hmm. Yep. We're going to have to keep most of the army here. Okay, so I'm going to... Actually, I'm going to keep you in here. That makes them kind of okay with us. We're going to have to build shrines. You guys are going to go sit... I don't know. What am I going to do with you? I guess I could grab General Picta here. Okay, I'll leave these two th units of Thracians. Ah, there we go. What else do you have? You've got archers. Alright, so we'll leave the hoplites. They can defend something else. Come over here. We'll do an army swap. So you're going to come defend this area. You'll march to here. You are going to go sit in a town. I'm not sure which one yet. What have we got in the way of armies? You can go sit in Ptolemaeus Holmos. There you go. Uh, you gentlemen are going to join up with Picta. As he leads his legion to glory. And you will begin advancing towards Bostra. Or at least in that general direction. Okay, I think we've got everything under control. We've got an army here that can take care of stuff as needed. General. We've got an army, well, we've got the legionaries on this boat, so once this place calms the fuck down, he can go take command, he can take the cavalry and take the Thracians with him. Can we get any just really iffy mercenaries or anything like that? General. Actually, we can. Okay, you sit here for just one minute. I need you, and I need you, and I need you. Alright, now how happy are they? 115%, alright. You join back up. Now what if I took him out? 75%! Beautiful. I will accept this. Okay, so you can stay there for a turn. That should add, what, 5% to happiness, and then this will add 10% after that. Low tax rate, I can live with it, I don't really need all that much money. I'm kind of bummed out that I didn't get the chance to murder everybody in the city. That's, uh, that's kind of disappointing. Only in Rome Total War would you say, oh, I'm terribly sorry that I didn't get my chance to butcher all the inhabitants of a city. That's a special kind of evil. <laughs> so I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a quick break here and when we return we will deal with this and this and this where is it there it is we need to take this city it will be ours so next time with me Grey Hunter Toodaloo